Well, good afternoon. I'm going to make a dessert for dinner tonight. I'm going to make a cobbler, a cowboy cobbler. Now, they are so simple to make. It's only two ingredients. Well, three if you count some butter that goes on it. But I'm going to show you how to make a super, super easy cowboy cobbler. Okay, you need only two items. A jiffy, yellow cake mix, cost 59 cents at Walmart, and a can of cherry pie filling here. Now, I don't know why, but the pie filling costs less than the fruit in the same size can. I don't know, maybe the fruit is higher priced than the uh, sugar and starch and things like that that they put in there to make the, uh, to thicken the filling, but at any rate, the pie filling is cheaper. I think it was a dollar seventy-nine. So that's less than two dollars and fifty cents that this cobbler is going to cost, and it's going to be a good one. Well, you want to get a pan that fits in your oven. This is the largest I have that will fit in this little toaster oven here. and spray it with pan. And open the cherry pie filling. Well, there's Frieda's clock telling us it's 3.45. And just spread that out in there. And the next thing you want to do is open this box of Jiffy Yellow Cake Mix. I could seal, so I'll have to cut this off. There we go. And it's got lumps in it, so what? Well, that's about enough. I've got about an inch left in the bottom. And now the other thing that I'm going to need to do is melt some butter and dribble this quarter cup of melted butter on top of the cake mix. You don't have to be too careful, it'll scatter itself around. <clears throat> and the oven is heated up on the bank to 350 degrees. And put it in, in the oven. 
just as close to the middle of it as you can get to get even browning on it. Now I'm going to leave that for about 30 minutes and check it. Set this on 30 minutes there. Okay, it's been a total of 45 minutes in the oven. I kind of sneaked up on it. And the top is nice and brown. Looks really good. One, two, one. Bring it over here to, to cool. There it is. Let it cool and it's ready for dinner. Yeah, that's nice and brown. Looks good, smells good. I'll bet it is going to be good. And there it is on the table ready to eat. Hope you enjoyed this video. I enjoyed making it. God bless America and God bless Texas.